I've got some hurt that I cannot wish away. Hope is hiding like a masquerade. I reach out for the one who can save me from myself. I just need a little help. Do you? The character that I played in the movie, her name is Shanti. She's a young woman um, who is battling her own insecurities, trying to meet society's expectations of beauty. And because of the standards of beauty in America and society being so high, she's kind of feeling uncomfortable in her own skin. The, the movie Modern Skin um, it's a pro short film project basically um, treating um, the issue of, of um, women and their insecurities and stuff like that. I hate my skin. The worst feeling of all is exposing myself to the world, then knowing I have to deal with criticism. It didn't take me long to prepare for that role because once upon a time, you know, I was a young adolescent girl, you know, with those same insecurities. The rehearsal started over the summer and we rehearsed almost every day. The director, of course, worked with me one-on-one -on -one as far as bringing out the character in me, making me feel emotion, um, showing me different sides to the character and things like that. So that we can make it a little more real so when the audience watch the film, they can actually, you know, feel the emotions that the characters, you know, was actually experiencing. Oh, how wonderful. I just love to see young women go out into the world. In the movie, I played a character named Betty. Betty was uh, like an angel figure, a motherly figure, a person who has some uh, wise things to say. But I was more so there to encourage the young lady in the movie to um, feel good about herself regardless to what her skin looked like. My favorite character, I would say, is Betty because she plays um, my guardian angel so to speak, and she kind of helped Shanti realize her true self and who she really is as a person, but at the same time, she kind of introduces God in her life and to, you know, show her that there's more to life than how you look. Every time that I look at myself in the mirror, that's what I see, my skin. Well, what is it that you see? Walk into the bus. I was really excited about the bus stop scene because I had, um, I've always wanted to shoot something in the bus stop, you know, because I remember the movie Forrest Gump, um, a lot of the action took place in the uh, bus stop and that was kind of a reference movie for us when we were preparing for this. The scene I um, later on enjoyed the most shooting was the uh, trance scene in the bathroom. Uh, because I was able to get a little creative with um, the camera angles. I was able to um, set up the scene in a way I, uh, that it was intriguing. I was able to capture the emotion of, of Shanti um, with the shot. I had the shot from up, uh, the Kashanda looking up to the camera and all that. And that was, that, was, that was interesting to shoot and it was also interesting to edit. I think people are going to love the fact that it's it's relatable. Um, it's the truth about how women, well, some women feel about themselves. And I think a lot of women can relate to this story. A lot of, especially a lot of young women who are uh, noticing flaws about themselves and they're comparing themselves to women on the cover of magazines and women in magazines and in movies. And, and they've got to understand that real people aren't that perfect. I thought it was fantastic. I thought it was a very intimate and very real 
um, story that so many women, especially experience, um, especially through the adolescents and young adults. What's this? This is my source. He can be your source too. It can give you a better understanding of who you are and what you can be. Well, I actually love it. Um, I think that it gave a different light to women. Um, I actually wanted to show my nieces the movie um, to let them know that they don't have to be the um, magazine TV type of girl to get the attention or to be a beautiful person. So I really thought it was an amazing film. You look beautiful. Thank you. I am more than my skin. My name is Crystal Shante, and I want to say to all the young women out there that you can do anything that you put your mind to despite the way that you look. Just know that with God on your side, all things are possible.